Hello, welcome to your IDS 105 focus video. I just wanted to take a moment and show you how you can find some of the different university resources here at SNHU directly from your Brightspace classroom. This is for any of your classes that you'll be taking here um, at SNHU. I wanted to point out that you go into your class in Brightspace, and if you're looking for the academic support team, you can find them right here at the top. Click on academic support and it'll pull up all of the services available from our wonderful academic support team. They offer anything from 24 seven drop in tutoring, which is where you can work with any first available tutors to ask course related urgent questions. Plus they have the written feedback option, which is where you can upload and submit your drafts and assignments for written feedback and you get that feedback within 12 hours. This is wonderful if you haven't um, been academically writing in a long time or ever, or if you struggle with your writing, this is a really great service for you to use. The academic support team also has a ton of workshops. They have peer tutoring and academic coaching, and then they also have the frequently asked questions section, which you can always read through on your own time. The biggest thing is if whatever you're looking for, click on the try it now button, and that'll get you to where you need to go to get scheduled for tutoring, show you how to upload your assignments for written feedback, get scheduled for workshops, peer tutors, or academic coaches. There's so much here for your support through the academic support tool. The other um, university resource I wanted to po point out is the Shapiro Library. This is a great place for you to be able to find quick access to things like how to cite your sources, frequently asked research questions, research guides, and then being able to explore the entire Shapiro Library homepage. These are two wonderful resources for your success to use in any of your classes. But we have so many more resources and you can find those by clicking on this little arrow underneath the help button, click on online student services, and it'll pull up all of the departments and teams here at SNHU. You will see the help desk, you will see the bookstore, there's another quick link to academic support, how to get in touch with the academic advisors, um, the Shapiro Libraries in here again, Student Financial Services, the Online Accessibility Center, SNHU Connect, where you can find clubs, organizations, and the IDS 105 learning community, um, SNHU Career Services, SNHU Wellness, a lot of students really like to explore InfoBase, which has a ton of technology tutorials and programs um, to teach you how to use some of the technology here at the university. If you do not have Microsoft Word, Office 365, and other software, if you click on this and follow the directions, you can get Microsoft Office 365, which is like Microsoft Word, PowerPoint, Excel. You will utilize Word in so many, if not all, of your SNHU classes, so it's a great um, software for you to have. You get that for free as an SNHU student. There's also some quick links that just show you how to navigate and interact with your Brightspace learning environment right here underneath this Brightspace learning environment spot. And then of course, again, the help desk is here for all of your technology needs. That's just a quick way for you to be able to access the university departments. As a reminder, you can pull them all up underneath that help button. Um, the online student services. There's also a quick link to the IT service desk. Plus there's a ton of student tutorial videos for you to explore. So there's so much at your fingertips. If you get stuck, you have any questions, don't hesitate to let your instructor or your advising team know. You got this, have a great day.